and break dancing. For breakers like Chino Lopez, it's made violence on the streets obsolete. Yeah, there was a lot of fighting, and the kids started figuring out, you know, we don't need this anymore. That's no good, you know. Let's do something worthwhile. Let's dance. And dance they did. Chino's crew, the New York City Breakers, is one group turning this territorial show of strength into an American dance sensation. I don't know when to go out. Although a crew lives by unity, each dancer has the freedom of individuality in his moves. Matthew, Ray, Bobby, Noel, Chino, and Tony. It ain't everyone that could do it like us. It's an attitude of anger, and your anger brings the strength. Sometimes we compete with each other, you know, and see who's the best. It represents you in the streets and a lot of emotion. You always want to be the best at it. Top notch, the best. That's what these kids fight for. Only now they do it with dance. But they don't take it lightly. It's still dangerous. Their warm-ups are self-designed to prepare their bodies for the break. But mostly what protects them from injury is their youth. The sunbreakers keep going to um, at least 20, 25 around there. Then they start slowing down. I hope I can keep doing it for a couple more years because I'm running out of time. I'm still young. I'm not thinking about that. But I guess as you get older, you can't do it no more. I do it because it's good for my body and it's good exercise. You know, I don't got to go jogging. I just do that and it's, I, make, I make money. Money, after pride and territory, is the motivation for developing talent. The money comes mainly from uptown Manhattan discos, which hire crews as entertainment. But even with hip-hop shows at the discos and bit parts in movies like Flashdance, breakers seem most at home on their streets. You know, go like downtown, open a box and start dancing in the street. People will see me and like they'll throw some money there. That's the way it really starting in the streets, you know. And why not? After all, this is makeshift American art. It is ragged and naive. Any neighborhood street is a stage. Pedestrians form an immediate audience in the round. Breaking borrowed from ballet. It took from tap and the martial arts. Added a distinct Bronx flair and became as much an art as a sport. Me, my whole crew, we challenged the 1984 gold medal winners in the floor exercise gymnastics team in a competition. Who knows, maybe someday it will be an Olympic event. And we'll see you in L.A. But Bobby, for his few words, captures breaking for what it is. No fights or nothing, but, you know, compete with one another. Good people just doing their thing. And you know this, and you know man, this, and you know man. This, and you know